SketchUp allows you to be so creative with your ideas that many users do not realize how easy it is to be accurate as well. Here's an overview of ways to work with accuracy in SketchUp. Most tools will respond to keyboard input. For example, start drawing a line in the direction you need and before clicking to finish the line, type a numeric value on your keyboard and press the Enter key. The default value is likely in inches or centimeters, but you can specify the unit of measurement. Continue drawing lines and type different values. I'll type 2m for this line, meaning 2 meters. Then continue in this direction and type in 6 apostrophe for 6 feet. I can also use 25cm for 25 centimeters. Other drawing tools also respond to keyboard input. For rectangles, specify the length and width separated by a comma, such as this example. Draw a rectangle of any size, then type in 3m, comma, 5m to create a rectangle that is 3 by 5 meters. For the circle, polygon, and arc tools, you can specify an exact radius for their shapes. You can be accurate while using many of the modification tools as well. Pull a shape and type in the exact distance you need. When specifying distance for the push-pull tool, remember that the distance is always measured from the initial location of the surface and relative to the direction of the push-pull operation. Here's a tip for being accurate and fast with the push-pull tool. Every time you use push-pull, SketchUp will remember the distance you used. Look at these three rectangles. Pull the first rectangle out a distance of 12 inches, then simply double-click on the next rectangle and the third rectangle to have the push-pull tool use the same distance. Push the top surface down a few inches, then double-click on the other surfaces to get the same distance. This functionality works on any surface you double-click on. The offset tool also lets you specify a distance. Simply begin your offset outward or inward and type the distance you need. By now, you should have a good idea of many ways to be accurate in SketchUp. You can also specify exact distances when moving objects and exact angles for rotating objects, all with keyboard input. Another way to be accurate is to create guides for you to reference. These guides are created with the Tape Measure tool. Simply click on an edge and pull away to create a reference guide. Remember that you can type in a distance for this guide. For example, I might pull off several guides at 6 inches so I know where to move the legs of this table. To create a specific point of reference, click on an endpoint and pull away. You can also create guides with the Protractor tool for accuracy with angles. When you have created models and need to communicate measurements, use the Dimension tool. You can pull dimensions off edges or between any two points, and even off of arcs and circles to show the radius. Look at other videos for more tips on being accurate with specific tools in SketchUp.